What's going on everyone? We have some serious developments to talk about that all kind of happen at the same time. There is a lot of stuff going on and as you know I like to keep up with this stuff. And those of you who care, um, this is for you. Those of you who don't, um, it is what it is. But this stuff is very relevant to the coming weeks and it's going to affect a lot of traders and investors. So what we're going to be looking at, and I'm going to put these out in a series of videos. I'm not going to cover them all in one video, that would be too, uh, too confusing. So I'm going to cover them individually. We have China recovery. We have the CPI numbers coming out on Wednesday. We have memes, meme stocks. We have metaverse. We have the repo that's going to be unwinding soon because, again, inflation. And last but not least, certainly not least, we have the ETF Bitcoin approval that I just got an email for about an hour ago. All this stuff is happening. All this stuff is relevant. And I wanted to show you real quick the... Bitcoin chart here for a moment because at FUDSTOP we have three main criteria that we look for and the criteria applies to everything across the market except for crypto because there's just too much liquidity until today so let me see what I'm, what I'm doing here where is crypto does crypto not on the desktop I think I'm just gonna search for it BTC, USD. So I want you to pay attention to something real quick before I get started with this. We have a gap on Bitcoin. Now, this is the first time I've ever seen this happen. It, this, this meets all three of our criteria. I'm not going to give it up what it is, but you could probably guess based on how my charts are set up. But, <coughs> excuse me, we have a gap on Bitcoin. Now, what does this signify? Well, it's an exhaustion gap. It means this trend here has been exhausted. This is the one of the easiest indicators of a reversal that you could see. And the reason why that this got gapped on the daily chart today is because just a little while ago, we had from the NASDAQ, and remember, China ADRs are tied to the NASDAQ. Order granting approval of proposed rule change as modified by amendment numbers one and two to list and trade shares of the Valkyrie XBTO Bitcoin Futures Fund under NASDAQ Rule 5711G. This email came out today. This was filed May 5th, but it was amended. And again, it came out today. It's it, one hour ago. And this is incredible shit because, I mean, just to see this on crypto is surreal. So, members who are watching, I mean, <laughs> This is the real deal, man. It's all coming together. So I'm going to get all this stuff out. I'm going to explain what it all is, why it's all relevant, and what it can mean for you. And again, these are unprecedented times. Complacency is going to be the destroyer of worlds in this market. Innovation will be key. Um, you know, just if you're one of those people that's set in your ways, things are not like they were ever before. Because <laughs> this was a bail-in, not a bail-out. So anyways, get all this stuff out soon.